Capricorn, this is Sophie, you guys. If you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, please click on the subscription box down there below. And this is your video about Venus on retrograde for Capricorn. What What's the effect? Okay, let's see what's the effect of the retrograde towards you, Capricorn. Okay, Capricorn, are you ready? Okay, what's the effect of <clears throat> Venus retrograde towards you? You do not feel toxic anymore. You do not feel tired. Okay, I can sense some of you are, you know, feeling relaxed. Way too much relaxed. Some of you are feeling lazy as well. Procrastination, lazy, or way too relaxed. Guys, this is not something that you, you want to be comfortable with having. This energy is kind of messed up. It's an imbalanced energy because Venus is on retrograde. It's affecting love and emotion. And you do not want to entertain this until the 25th, guys. Because if you're going to get used to it, what will happen when it comes to your love life and when it comes to the things that you matter to you the most? What if there are projects that need to be done and then you're lazy, you're procrastinating and stuff like that? Okay, this is an imbalance and I will teach you what you need to do in order to counter-attack this one, in order to neutralize this energy because it will be like this until the 25th of June, guys. You do not want that, right? It's a long way to go. It's like close to one month. Yeah. Okay, since I'm uploading it kind of late. So, it may be close to one month, you guys. So, let me see what you need to do in order to neutralize the energy of being lazy and procrastination. First things first, you need to communicate. You need to initiate, you know, a movement to talk. Who's the person that you need to talk to that will ignite the fire within you, that will inspire you to do things? You need to make that bold move. You guys make it fast because you do not want the days to run and you're not finishing anything. Be sure you're going to make that move, guys. Make that move to talk to that person, Capricorn. Okay, another thing, Capricorn, be a slave. Be a slave to, your, to yourself. Do something that will really bring out the hard work, hard working individual within you. Um, I can sense you need also to lower your pride and ego. Okay, in order for you to do things that will make you, you know, be productive. Okay, all I can sense is be productive. Get out of the laziness mode. Um, be hard working. Be a slave to yourself. Do something that would really make you, um, make the time worthwhile while waiting for Venus retrograde to be over. Okay, again, make sure you're going to talk to someone who's going to give you an inspiration so that you'll be able to wake up each day feeling the vibe. I want to finish this. I want to finish that because I'm feeling so in love and positive and all those sorts. Okay, because I know Capricorn, you have been lazying around. Mm -hmm, lazy and procrastinating, right? Get out of that, get out of that, get out of that. Because you are way too relaxed already. And it will be like this until June 25th, you guys. Okay? So this has been your reading, Capricorn. Thank you so much for watching. And please subscribe to my YouTube channel. And sending you energy of love, love, love. And abundance, 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 Capricorn.